Hey, Nick here with this week's Indie Mon. I'm playing Hotline Miami 2. It's available on Steam for all operating systems and PlayStation 3 through 4, including the Vita for $14.99. I've been waiting a good amount of time for Hotline Miami 2 to come out. I enjoyed the first one and still listen to some of the songs off the soundtrack to this day. Can a sequel live up to the first game and will it have just as good of a soundtrack? Well, yes, it does exactly that. Hotline Miami 2 puts you in the role of a couple different people as you murder your way to the end. Yes, it's violent, but you saw my little warning at the beginning. I knew your curiosity would get the best of you. The story in Hotline Miami 2 was more memorable than the first games. There were moments I wanted to get the story part over with just to get to the next level. There's a skip story button that you can press if you need it, but the story was good for the most part. The levels were designed nicely as you try to figure out the best plan to get to the most people. There's so much you can do in any levels for the most part. Sure, there's some characters or masks that don't allow weapons, but most characters let you use a wider range of weapons. So do you use as many bullets as possible to get a long range, but risk running out of bullets? Maybe you could try to use a blunt object so it doesn't make any loud noises attracting other enemies to come rolling your way? Hotline Miami 2 does a good job keeping things interesting. It requires you to use different characters with unique talents. There's also many settings these levels take place in. One moment you're in the jungle and the next you're in the hottest nightclub in the area. The soundtrack? What's there to say about it? It lives up to the first game, and I couldn't be more happier about it. It did so well keeping an intense environment while you worked your way into each level. The game lived up to my hype towards it. Hotline Miami 2 is great, and the only thing I could mention on the downside is that there would be a dog doing circles once in a while in a glitchy way. Not a big deal since when I got close it would snap out of it. Hotline Miami 2 is a must play for fans of the first one, and if you haven't played either, you need to change that. Thanks for watching the whole video, please like, subscribe, and come back for new videos every week.